Hey, my friend. Uh, I wanted to talk about uh, free will today. Um, this came up in conversation with someone uh, a few days ago. And uh, when this particular person brought it up, I noticed there was an air of importance placed around it. Uh, and it reminded me of um, my mother talking about free will when I was a child. My mother is a very uh, hardcore Catholic woman, uh, God-fearing woman. And, uh, and when I was a child, uh, she would sometimes bring up uh, this fact that we have been given free will by God and that it is a precious gift that you should not screw up, you know. Uh, otherwise, you know, you're going to hell. You're going to burn in hell. Because, uh, you know, if you make the wrong decisions, uh, well, tough, tough shit, you know. Uh, and, uh, and that always sat a little strangely with me. So I wanted to talk to you more about this idea of free will and how essentially it's one giant ego trip. Um, because it implies that you need to behave in such a way that pleases some external entity or society or whatever. And the result of that is you give up your freedom, your inner freedom to become someone you're not, to become something you're not uh, out of fear. So it's a mechanism of control. You know, that's why these, a lot of religious institutions love you know, talking about this idea of free will. It's kind of like, you know, how we tell kids, you know, you better be nice so that you're not on Santa's naughty list. Uh, you have a chance to behave the right way before Christmas. You know, it's a mechanism of control and a mechanism of keeping you in prison because you're always looking over your shoulder. Am I doing the right thing? Am I going in the right direction? Is it okay to just relax at this point? Should I be doing something differently? You're always questioning being alive. You're questioning being. And, you know, if you think about it, life would be pretty shitty if you... had to live life according to some ideal, as you know very well, I'm sure. All of the suffering comes from living up to, trying to live up to an ideal. And that's what this free will is all about. Trying to live up to an ideal. Now, in terms of the setup here, the setup of existence, this idea of free will that we can choose our own course is extremely important for this illusion to seem real so that we can experience, have a very vivid experience of suffering, of what suffering is. Because only if you believe that you can choose right or choose wrong can you experience suffering? You experience suffering even when you're, when you think you're choosing right, because you have to maintain it and you could lose that at some point, that good habit. You could screw it up at some point. So either way, it's very important, this idea of free will to give us human beings a very visceral experience of 
suffering. So it's not an accident, you know, we don't have a choice but to believe in free will. But uh, if you've played this game on the planet long enough and you've tried your best to make the right choices, be the best you can be, uh, and you still haven't arrived at a place of deep inner peace, of real a real lightness of being, a real joyfulness, then you're blessed because you're ready to see through this delusion of free will. That the message has always been there. It's been passed down through the ages, but we've always kind of overlooked it. It's even been in, you know, the religious scriptures. Thy will be done. Not... Thy will be done, and my will too. Thy will be done means whatever happens is supposed to happen. And it couldn't be any other way. Regardless of whether I think I made the choice myself or not. I am nothing more than an instrument. A divinely animated instrument, a tool for the divine to move through. And yes, the divine is acting through all human beings, creating the atrocities and the acts of love, all of it. There is no separate individual ego making wrong choices. It doesn't exist. But for the ego, this phantom identity, it loves to feed on this concept of free will because there's an air of power embedded in it. It boosts the ego's sense of realness belief in being real when it feels like it has the power of choice. But true wisdom is choicelessness, is surrendering your individual will to the one will of life, allowing life to act through you, to flow through you, through acceptance, through trust, in whatever happens next. You also just can't relax. You notice that? If you have free will, holy shit, you know? How can you enjoy being alive If there's a rule book, you can't. It's necessary for, you could say, younger souls or middle-aged souls, you know, that are still kind of susceptible to bumping into things and hurting themselves. If you're a parent, you know what I'm talking about. Rules are important when you're at a certain age, you know? As a parent, you have to use rules with your children. Otherwise, they will hurt themselves because they don't know any better. They have to learn through experience, and that takes time. And in the case of souls, you could say it takes lifetimes. But, you know, when you become an old soul, and you look at the rule book, you tend to smile at it more and not take it so seriously. You don't need it anymore. You've lived long enough to know that when you live out of alignment with life, when you harm life, you harm yourself. And it's not worth it anymore. So you just naturally move 
in a respectful way, in a joyful way, with very little negative consequences coming to you. Not because you're making the right choice, but because you've realized that trying to follow the righteous path is what's created all of the problems all along. So, uh, I just wanted to get that off my chest, uh, say hello again, uh, let you know that I am offering hypnosis sessions and self-inquiry sessions. So you can book yourself in through the link below in the description, uh, or you can just head to my website, kylehuben.com, and look for the Work With Me page. I'd love to work with you. I'd love to see you. Any other questions, feel free to message me. I'll see you next time. Bye for now.